Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be planning the week of Monday, October 7th through Sunday, October 13th and I will be using this uh, kit from Libby & Co. As you can see it's already been used so this is a leftover kit from a couple years ago and these sheets used to be um, these full time, full time, full size sheets. However, um, they didn't fit in my new binder system so I just cut them up to make them fit. And then I also have, in addition to the kit, some uh, stickers from leftover kits from either previous years or possibly even multicolor sheets that I just put on the stick, uh, blank sticker paper to use this week and I'll be pulling from this and I most likely will be having to pull from my collection as well. These were just stickers that I knew I would be using. And then finally, I'll be using this Erin Condren dual tip marker in lemon and then this yellow Sharpie as my marker. So the Sharpie I write on the stickers and then the uh, dual tip marker I write on the paper. So today is actually Monday around 4 o'clock. It's the earliest that I could have filmed this. So Monday will at least be back planning and then I'll be planning everything else throughout the week. And I have a reference sheet. This was from like the Target dollar spot years ago. Um, that I just quickly scribbled um, some things that I'll be doing. So let's go ahead and get started. I might actually zoom in a little bit. Okay, that's a little bit better. So let's go ahead and get started. I think I'll start with my sidebar. And I know I have some full boxes. Oh, here we go. Some full boxes here. So I think I'm going to use one of the multicolored ones. And I think I like this one the most. So for multicolor weeks like this, I always like to use the multicolor stickers because the solid color stickers I could always carry over and use for another week. But I'm more likely to need a, a yellow full box than a yellow, orange, brown full box, you know. So I like to keep everything as matchy matchy as I can. So let's see here. So what do I normally do? And then I have a habit tracker and I don't think habit trackers come in the kit, no, so. So first I like to check this notebook. I got it from, where did I get this from actually? Oh, Amazon. And I just put in my leftover stickers in here to reference, so let's see. And I don't really like how this is right now. Um, oh, there's a brown one. This is from Pretty Sheepy, I believe. No, Adloop, Adloop, this is from Adloop. I'm not really liking this how it is. I think it's a little too small. As you can see, some of the pages are like overflowing. Um, and I don't really like how I put the words up here and labeled them. So once I finish this, I might um, make my own like Sarah Marie did. If you check out her channel, she kind of designed her own book with like Office Max or something like that. So I may do that. Okay, so Habit Tracker. And then I have, let's see, oops, wrong binder. Um, I also need to reorganize my stickers. They're not very organized. So I have these pill trackers that I've been using, but I'm not liking any of these colors and I don't think I'll be reordering them. I'm just going to use them as I use them and as they coordinate with the colors. So since these don't coordinate, I'm not going to use, use one this week. And then I think I track, yeah, so I track the book that I'm reading for the week as well as my Instagram followers so I usually use really thin um, stickers for that or labels and they don't know they're not in the kit so I think I'm going to use I don't order from scribble punch scribble punch scribble prints co that much anymore but I like these colors so I think I'm going to take these and if I do order from her I actually have a whole nother sheet of her SPC logo right here. So if I do order from her, I'll just use these. And I just, I keep forgetting that I have these shop specific logos. So once I do order from someone, I just use a general like envelope sticker and I always forget to use these. So even though this is not what it was meant for, this is how I'm gonna use it. So I'm gonna put the book on top 
and this yellow probably won't write that well. I don't know if you guys probably won't be able to see it, but, um, oh, I can see it, okay. So right down the book, oh, it's also right down my habit. You can't really see that check mark at all, so I might actually just color the day in. I don't know if you guys can see it that well, but I can see it on my end, so. And then I need a phone sticker. So let's see, I keep forgetting where I put them. I think, I don't, I actually don't think they're in here. So this section is like my sidebar section. Yeah, no, I just had the books in here, which is I already pulled from to get this sticker. And then for my phones, which I actually pretty much only use them in my sidebar, but for some reason I keep them in my technology section, which I, get, I mean, they are technology, but I pretty much only use them for sidebar. So at some point I need to move these over to my sidebar. So let's see what sticker I wanna use. I think the yellow, I like. I think I like that, how the yellow and orange are switched over here. Yeah. And I actually haven't checked yet, so I'm just gonna leave that blank, because I don't know the number. And then I have a dinner section. Oh, actually I didn't have a, that's why, okay. I pulled these, because they actually don't have a dinner sticker. I, I think I already checked that, oh, weekly habits sticker that matches these colors so I'm not going to do that excuse me I have these instead so this will just be a giant to-do list which do I have a to-do sticker left I don't believe so no I don't so let's pull from here most of these are cleaning there's not really a to-do Oh, here's a to-do, sweet. I have an overflow section, so if one of these pages gets too full, I just put it here. So here's the to-do. I actually think I might wipe this out. Ooh. Kind of put this in the middle there. Actually, you know what? To make this spacing a little prettier, I have these from also from Libby and Co. I just love Libby and Co. Um, let's see. There's no brown. This is yellow and that's orange. There's no red really in this kit, so I guess I'll just use this yellow. Kind of takes up some space and adds a little bit decoration there i like that okay and then i think i'm going to fill in these with these dots and i'm not going to do it on camera actually i'll probably do it afterwards but i'll probably just rotate these dots down there to make a checklist because I, I hate that these are every other and i like in the new um the new year aaron condren they're not like that which makes me happy Okay, so I think I'm gonna do the, uh, or the, excuse me, the washi next. So I pulled these from an old Scribble Prints Co. washi sheet. These were from the August monthly colors. But obviously you can use it whenever. And the, you can see how old these are. These are actually matte, which really speaks to how long I've had these stickers for. So I'm just gonna finish, oh, did I do this the right way? Yeah, I did, okay. I forgot which order I put them on. Okay, so this extra sheet is done. And then I wanna do a weekend and I did not, oh yeah, I already used the weekend, the weekend banner used to be here. I already used it. So, I need to go to my multicolors and I think here. Let's see. So either of these would work well. Ooh, actually, 
I might want to use like a brown or tan or something since I don't really use that many kits with the brown. I think that's too dark. That one's too light. Yeah, I like that this brown the best. And I just, I love this weekend banner. This weekend banner from Libby & Co is my favorite. I will definitely be, let's see, I'll shift it down here. Let's be real. I'm not going to be awake before 9 a.m. on a weekend. Um, oh, actually, this weekend I will go, unfortunately. Um, so actually, I'm going to move this up a little bit. But this weekend banner is my favorite from Libby & Co. I definitely will be repurchasing it. Okay, and they come in multiple color combinations. Okay, so let's start with Monday. So Monday... Let's see, what did I do? Okay, so let's start with my classes since those I know about. Um, let's see here. I might just go down order. Let's see, so I had a class at 10.30. I have that same class again Wednesday at 10.30, but then we have an extra class. Um, actually, I'm not going to use this color. I'll put this one here. I don't have class on Tuesday because I'm the TA for this class, and um, they have their midterm on Tuesday, and I don't need to be there. So, But I do need to be there on Tuesday because that's when there's a normal class. Okay, and then we have a makeup class for one of my classes. That's at one. I normally don't have class then, but I will this week. And then I have office hours. Again, I'm in the TA for a stats class. So that's office hours from three to four. And then I have a seminar at one. Okay, so my classes and then my other appointments, I guess, will be in the appointment labels. Okay. So then, let's see, I also like to post my Instagram schedule in here. I don't know Oops. if I have, I have these from Planner-esque. I don't have that many left, as you can see, and I actually don't even have that many in this color combination, so I'm not even going to mark my schedule down. But I will be receiving a package from Planner Kate today. When I came home from work or from school, I saw the mail woman at our mailboxes. So I know I will be getting it today. So I'm going to use one of her stickers from her sticker sheet that says Planner Kate Happy Mail Day. And I'm just going to put it up here just to fill in this empty gap. Okay, and then I had class. And I didn't really do anything until I came home to film. So let's see. Okay, so I'm gonna use this one. Let's see. Oh, actually, I think this fits the entire, it does. Okay, perfect. So this will be, oh, you cannot see this yellow at all but I know what this means. So this is my film edit upload, which I'm actually doing right now. And then let me put my class in. But you also can't see very well, but that's okay. And then during the day, I just worked and I don't really mark that. So I think I'm gonna just use one of these full boxes because I don't need to make a sticker that says work. Awesome, and then tonight, I'll be eating dinner. Let's see, actually, because I have a lot, because there's a show tonight, and I'll be doing laundry and dinner, and then, let's see, there's a TV sticker. Oh, I should be able to fit all this. So, the TV show is last. Laundry will be right after. Actually, I'm gonna shift this up a little, even though it's not really true to the time but it's fine 
Laundry will be right after this. And then I'll have dinner. There's a lot of yellow down here, but that's okay. Perfect. Okay, so that's Monday. Tuesday, I will be working from home. So I probably will be waking up a little later than usual. So I'm just going to put this here. Um, so on Tuesdays, I have T-Mobile. So they have a T-Mobile Tuesday. Sport goal, which they released their new badges on Tuesday. So I like to see the new badges. And oh, actually I actually have to do my um, week one budget. And that'll be another filming day or not even a full day, just a little bit. So I'll probably do that earlier in the day while the light is better. Again, that's film, edit, upload. Okay, it looks weird with two checklists back to back, but that's okay. And then that will probably go up Wednesday. Actually, I might space it out a little bit more. So I think, ooh, actually, because I'm only going to have two. Oh, no, because I'm going to do a family planner, Kate. I'm going to have to do two of them because I have to do my planner, Kate, haul. So, okay, this is what I'll do. I won't use these. Maybe I'll use, no, actually, I'm, I'm going to use the teardrops. Oh. Okay, so this day will be when my plan with me goes up. So maybe that's how I'll split it up. So this will be when my plan with me goes up and then I'll film the quarter one budget and planner Kate Maybe I'll put the quarter two budget, or excuse me, the week one budget. Wow. Ugh, that's the same color. The week one budget will go upload this day, and then my planner Kate haul will go up this day. week one budget and then okay hot awesome and the rest of the day I'll probably do homework and stuff and then obviously eat dinner so I'll use this one To go here and I like to center it. I know it doesn't fill the entire box, but I just like to center it. Oh, actually, I'm gonna have to ship all these up. The good thing about Libby and Co. is they're super removable, which I, I so appreciate. Um, because I like, as you can see, I have to move everything around like all the time. So I'm gonna shift this up because there's also another TV show this day, and I don't think I don't I don't have another TV sticker, that's okay. I don't really like that they're different, but you gotta do what you gotta do. And then dinner. Okay, so this TV show is Dancing with the Stars. And then this on Tuesday is The Masked Singer. Okay, so let me just make sure, I haven't even been referencing this at all, I've been going off of my memory. So let's just make sure that that's right. Okay, so I don't have any Instagram stickers, so I'm not gonna do, and oop, actually this yellow is, 
is black. So I'm not going to do any of my Instagram. I still will post, obviously, but I'm not going to mark it in here. So dancing with the stars, I marked. Class, I marked. Um, this I actually moved to Tuesday, the Planner Kate Hall. This is my list to do. So I did Sport Gold, T-Mobile, Quarter One Budget, I wrote down. I don't have class this day, actually, so that's done. These are all the to-dos that I'll write down here once I put those um, these dots on, but I'm not going to do that now. 8 p.m. Oh, the mass Singer's on Wednesday, not Tuesday. Darn it. I thought they were on Tuesday. Whoops. That's annoying. I might have to double check this. Watch it actually be on Tuesday, and I was right the first time, but... Great thing about Whiteout, I can just do it over again like nothing ever happened. Great. Okay, so Mass Singer. I didn't mark my classes yet, so let's do this. So 10.30. Oop, I don't write the time. Let me ask 7.13, 7.13. .13. And then 3 p.m. I have office hours. Yeah, actually this yellow was probably a bad choice, but oh well. So I marked down all of this. So Wednesday, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday are done. Thursday, again, I have class. Or this is the class that I'm TAing for, so I just sit in. And then we have a guest speaker coming, Megan Rampino. Rampino I'm not sure how to pronounce her name. I'm so sorry. Um, but she is coming. And I'm going to go see her talk, which I'm super excited about. So I have to take, actually, I might mark it from when it actually is. I think it starts at 5. Oh, goodness, what time does it start? See, I did not, because I just signed up for this last minute. Because I think I have to be there around, I think it starts at 5. Yeah, it starts at 5, but I should be there around 4. It ends at 6.30, so I'm just going to make this end at 6.30, and then whatever. It's only about an hour and a half time slot, but that's okay. So, and it's called What Matters to You. And then again, I'm going to put... A box here because in the meantime I'll just be at the library studying um, or just killing time which is not really that important what I'm doing so let's see what I think this washi will fit the best no. I think this is too thick oh actually that's not terrible I'm gonna just do this one Okay, and then that'll just be the rest of the night, and then I'll just come home and have dinner. Let me just put dinner down here. Okay. And then Friday I have class at 1. It's to seminar. And then Saturday and Sunday, I actually have a workshop. It's kind of like a one credit weekend long class. So I'm not sure what time it starts. I believe it's either at 1030 or 830. But I'm just going to put these here. And I don't know how I'm going to mark it because it basically goes until 430. So... I'm just going to write the name of the class, Ooh, which is, I messed up, but that's okay. Okay, I'm 
And then Saturday, I have an engagement party to go to. And that's at seven. And I should be there on time. Because like I said, my class gets out of 4.30 and this place is like a, a little over an hour away. So I should have enough time to get there. But I already told them I might be a little late, so it's okay. Okay, so this, other than laundry, oh, did I hit my laundry? I did not. Okay, at some point I'll do my nails, not sure when. We'll figure it out. And then laundry. And so I actually use these stickers week to week. So I'm just going to put them on next week. As you can see, I already pre panned a little bit. So this is done. And then I believe that's all I'm going to do for now. I actually have to mark... Because that's when we're eat dinner. So I don't think I'll put a sticker on this day. So this sheet is done. I'm going to put this back on the multicolor sheet. I don't need any more checklists. So this sheet is done. Unless I run out of things to do here and here, I might add another one. But for now, I don't need one. Let's see. Page flags, another checklist. Is it anyone's birthday this week? No, no. No, so I'm not going to use the either of these probably. So this sheet is done. Cleaning. I probably will. Oh, we'll do go grocery shopping probably sometime on the weekend, so I'll use this one. I don't get paid this week. Probably won't go shopping this week, won't get gas. I'm not going to use these. So this one's done. Here's the washi and the full boxes. I will be adding these at some point throughout the week, probably. Actually, I'm just going to do it now because I know I have stuff to do. I know that these, I won't be doing anything else during this time because it's a day-long workshop. So I'm just going to put these in now. Um, just to make sure that I have enough because I don't think I have enough arrows to fill it. It doesn't match up exactly, but actually, I'm going to do this upside down just to make it a little bit straighter. So I think it ends at 4.30. So I probably won't get home until a little before 6. So this is, this is a good distribution. And then, oh, that is super good. So this one, I did not put the half box on straight. So that's why that's crooked. Oh, I hope this will fit. If not, then that's okay. And I like how they kind of match the browns. So. Just finish off that washi. Okay, they're not exactly even. That doesn't bug me too much. So, if anything, I'll just treat that as forget we got out of class early or something. So, this one's done. And just to finish off this page, because again, these stickers are so removable that if I end up doing something this morning, it'll be an easy fix to just pull it up and move it somewhere else. So I'm just gonna put this down now. So this sheet I can now throw away. And then lastly, I'm gonna put these down here to finish my to-do list. And then I'm not uploading any more videos this week, so this one's done. If other activities come up here, I'll probably fill it in. And then the same with the icons, but for now, nothing else is done. So again, thank you for watching this plan with me. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you can, go ahead and hit that like button as well as subscribe and leave a comment down below how busy your week is looking because 
this was a lot more than I was expecting it to be. It's going to be a busy week and then next week is midterm. So it's going to be a little bit busier, but that's okay. So again, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.